Hey all, welcome to Helheim, the sixth or seventh, I think, location of the Odin side quest. So we are at Hell's home now to find the next sprout. Hmm. Well, we have a gate up there, and we have so many ghosts here. The location is 621 tiles, but you have a rage sized. Oh, this is usually the man who gives us traveler's stamp. We need to break the cursed totems of hell. Mm, how is that done? So this looks like the stone that we have to break to proceed and that seems to have worked except this guy did not go away so we cannot access that chest. Uh, what? Did anything change? Don't think so. Another totem, yes, this one is accessible. Okay, some others have now disappeared. And one of this totem I think was earlier inaccessible, now it is accessible. Let's see, some other ghosts will disappear after digging this. That's right. And this looks like the final one. Yup, the gate has opened up. All of the ghosts have now disappeared, which means we can now also get that lower chest. And I guess no tiles left now. So we are good to continue. The first section had 220 tiles. We still need about 400 more. Several more totems. Okay, it has unlocked a bridge. And there's another totem across that bridge. But first, we have to dig maybe this one. Yep, it's the only one currently accessible. Another path opened. Ah, uh, not where we want to go. We must dig the other totem first on the right. Hmm, now the central bridges are being built. So two more totems and maybe all of them will get built. Ah, 
uh, this is not all accessible nor is the other one so what are you supposed to dig now there are actually hidden tiles behind so is there a different way to access those I don't see one Hmm. Is something wrong or is there... Okay. There's a hidden tile and... That's the next totem you had to dig. Okay, that was hard. Maybe you may have stuck there. Okay, now one last and we shall be done. Only a few more ghosts left which will go after that last totem. Oh, don't forget the red and tiles behind. They do include some of these. Okay, another set and we shall unlock the gates. Let me just go ahead and get that other totem first. Then we can access any area with all the open gates. There we go. All the gates are open and in fact, we can also get the sprout. Um, why are there more totems? Okay, all that must be for the traveler's stamp. But we will solve that later. First, let's collect the sprout. The main objective of the quest is complete. At a little more than halfway. Now let's figure this out. Well, the ghost is standing in front of pretty much all the totems, so there's only one we can access at this point. Let's go ahead with that. Mm. All that is fine, but now how do we figure out which stone goes where? Is there an hint or something? Nothing under the stones. Um, maybe let's continue. Mm, I don't see any sort of end. That's not the one, this is the one with the open totem. And now that last totem, maybe now we will get the hint. The gate has opened, maybe somewhere there is our hint. the traveler hmm. well that is again fine but then we still haven't figured out which stone to put where let's continue maybe we will figure that out soon okay that's a hidden wall there Central totem accessible. The one on the right. And up there. Okay, hidden tile.
Hmm, that could be a hint now. have a treasure part there. Let's go ahead and get that. And that's a part of a replica of a trussel something. And that was actually the last part. So we have got the treasure now. Now all we need to do is place the stones outside according to the pattern which is blue, green, red, green. Mm, not many tiles behind them. Blue. Green. Red Green Um There was no sort of indication or anything So I don't know if that is done right But yes Those were the colors But this doesn't have seem to work Okay, it actually worked. You just had to take a step further for it to actually open up. So yes, that was the combination. And we can now get the stamp, maybe in that chest. Mm, no. Right, this bigger golden chest, that has the stamp. Well, that's not all the tiles. We have missed four tiles somewhere, which probably is some hidden tile or something. But no, three were here itself. So one tile somewhere. Now where could that be? It could be one of these jars. Maybe we forgot to tap one of them. No, that's not the case. Let's go ahead and use the last finder. That's what it's made for. Yep, it's somewhere back there. It will help us throughout, so we don't need to worry about that. The last tile. It's somewhere even back further, so if I were to manually look for it, then I would have completely explored this area first. That would have led to a lot of time wastage. Oh. Just missed your chest there. So yes, that was the last tile. So thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Oh, and do talk to Odin in the city to complete the quest and get the next one. So that's it. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.